Already registered with the Electoral Office, the Progress Party has as its political leader, Kerry Vallon Simmons, a resident of Guam St. John's with academic qualifications and military experience. He is being supported at the moment by Javon John, Youth Executive, Marilyn Brathwaite, Secretary, Executive Members Wilma Fortune, Brittany Simmons, Sherlyn George, and Treasurer Rick Duncan. The political leader Simmons says he came from humble beginnings and this he would use to shape policies and ideas going forward. I want people to know that I came from a very uh, dirt poor family. That's my foundation and I've always been taught to never forget where you came from. Um, my, my, I, I saw my mom um, sell limes and tambourines and cans and stuff like that just so she can buy uh, school uniform and stuff like that to put us to school. It's only by pure luck that I was able to, uh, to be afforded the opportunity to go overseas and study. I did good. Like, okay, in school, I was accepted at Columbia University out of high school, and, but because we didn't have the money to put me through the program, I, I originally wanted to be an engineer. But we didn't have the money to put me through the program, so um, that's where the military option came in. So I ended up going to the military, uh, and that is how I was able to pay for my education. But I would never forget my roots. But at the end of the day, I want people to know that I am not looking for anything in return. With the Pegasus as its symbol and its motto, Change is Progress, the newly formed political party says it is focused on a number of issues, key of which, according to the political leader, is that of the state of health care in Grenada. My main and top concern is, is our health system. I just think it's, it's, it's messed up the way it is. You know, you know, I urge anyone to just take a walk into the general hospital and look at the conditions there because, you know, there is, I don't believe there is AC at all. The last time I was there, there was no AC. You look at uh, the furniture and, and stuff, it's all rusted out. Um, you look at uh, the beds. You, you, you know, people have to bring their own bed sheets and stuff. And I think the reason uh, we have some of those issues is because, uh, you know, e economic, the, the economy as a whole. So we have to find a way to focus on how we can get this economy going because we are in a recession. Javon John, youth executive, is popularly known in the entertainment industry as Vaughn or Little Vaughn. He says although there are no plans to join frontline politics, he is determined to be a beacon of change, particularly for issues affecting the youth. I really want to see a change in, in many things in, in terms of music in this country because, I mean, I've overheard an interview just a while ago where uh, someone was saying that, they, they, well, it was clear to me that they understand what music and entertainment can do for a country. And I don't think that... The, the people that are in charge or the people that are responsible for making the change are doing enough. And we know that if they do enough, it can help our economy, it can help our country. Healthcare, uh, if a young person gets sick, we would like to know that when we go to the hospital or when we go for our medical attention that we are sure, we are certain that, you know, we will get the healthcare and the, that we deserve. To be honest, I, I don't think I will <laughs> be a candidate, or, uh, but I will continue speaking for the people that I love. The Progress Party says it would not be contesting the upcoming general election as it would need time to build its support base. However, it will continue to be vocal on a number of issues going forward. Eugenia Peters, GBN News.